I would have probably smashed his head about another 10 times. Other stuff. That's one hell of a mess. Oh, I already saw that. Okay, so this basically just loops around the train. Okay. All right, we got cookies. We'll give these cookies to baby girl. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything? In no, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Oh, Lord. Ah! Went in and went out, yeah. Alright, appreciate y'all dropping by. <clears throat> there we go. There we go. Alright, let's fix this map. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Alright. Come down, up, 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 down, up. Down, down, up. Up. Down. Up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Hey, that. Alright, so actually the first one's turned sideways, the other one's turned. <clears throat> now we're talking. Okay, then sideways left and sideways right. Out here.
definitely pry this thing free. If I can break it loose first. I had the right uh, tool. A different tool. And got it. Long side. I always get these sides mixed up. Now let's try this. It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free.
shit! We're golden! Oh, here we are. Yeah, we are. Golden. Man, feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. It's all yours. Damn it. Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. Yeah, I got the right tool. Kenny, we're loose. You touch any of my stuff? Oh, man. Wow. <laughs> he got it in my face. Who are you? Stuff. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But <laughs> I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still <laughs> kind of freaking me out. Trying to do that. I already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. Nice. So we have a new person. Got a guitar. Chuck. Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy. Ben, too. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> uh oh. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Howdy. Um, where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. Here, I found this. 
duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. Kiddo. Hey, sweet sweet girl. Lee. That candy Chuck gave you. It taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. Scary, kind of. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Hey, on. Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Yes. What? We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. We fine. We'll be fine. We've gone through just as much as anybody else. This one's gonna grow up quick. I already am. I don't doubt it, son. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Oh no, Doc! Long <sighs> walk. Right, Kenny. You need to stop the train. Show you the blood. Kenny, 
What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Sorry. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. This isn't about... It's not about my son dying. What the hell do you know? You're not my friend. I don't hate you. You sure as shit haven't done anything for me. But... You think you're the reason Duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? You didn't kill Herschel's son. Yes, I did. Oh, you did? Now it's catching up to me. That's not what went down. You looked out for your kid, but a bad thing happened to someone else's. There ain't no way this world lets my son live when I help put someone else's in the ground. That's not the way it works. You know that. Stop the train, man. I did some tough love. Wow, we didn't even fight Kenny. On my other profile, I actually fought Kenny. Stop him. Calmed him down. Ken, it's... I think it's time. The boy's been bit.